Hey guys, so today I'm going to teach you how to install your localhost on your MacBook. Let's first find out what a localhost does. So let's go to the top over here and go to localhost. And let's go to the WordPress folder because I want to show you how to install your WordPress on your localhost. And as you can see, I have WordPress here installed on my localhost and it means that this site right now is hosted on my computer, not on the internet. This does two things. Number one, when I make changes to the theme, I can see the changes instantly without having to upload it to the internet. And secondly, I don't need the internet to actually access this. So I can actually work on the theme without the need for the internet. So I can work on it at the beach, at the mall, at the library, at my girlfriend's, wherever, right? So wherever um, I find it convenient and I get my creative juices flowing. So let's go ahead and install that. First thing we need to do, let's go to the top here and let's go to MAMP. And go ahead and click on the first one you see, map.info. And you're going to have two choices. The one on the left you actually have to pay for, and the one on the right is free. And we like free things. So let's choose the one on the right. Again, they're persistent. The one on the bottom you pay for, so let's click on the one on the top. And I want you to go ahead and download it. I actually already did download it, so I'm going to hit cancel, but you can hit OK. So let's go. OK, and here in my downloads folder you'll see I have the map.dmg. Go ahead and double click that and install it and put it in your applications folder. And here in the applications folder, let's scroll down to MAMP. And double click on the MAMP. Cool. And I think the first thing you're going to see is it's going to automatically open up the start page. We don't have to necessarily worry about this now. And let's configure your preferences. So you're going to start off in the start stop. Make sure the, the top two are selected and then you don't really want to check constantly for MAMP, MAMP Pro and you don't really want to open it at the start page. So unclick those, have those two clicked. Ports, uh, you want to click on set to default Apache and MySQL ports. So the top will be 80 and the one on the bottom will be 3306. PHP, I have mine on PHP 5 and this was important guys. Um, I think you're going to have the default document route. So I want you to first go to your finder and here in your username I want you to create a new folder called localhost. Localhost. I already have one called localhost, so I'll just hit cancel, but you go ahead and create that folder. And now here I'm going to hit select and go to my new localhost folder and hit OK. Open. And you're going to hit OK. I'm going to hit cancel. And you're pretty much all set. There's one other thing that we need to do, which is to install this cool little icon right here. Uh, it's really convenient for you to start and stop your localhost. And to install this MAMP widget, all you need to do is go back to your MAMP folder. And for some reason, I don't have it in here, but in your MAMP folder, you're going to find something called the MAMP.widget. Go ahead and double click it and install it, and you'll go ahead and install that. Great, so that's how you install your localhost on your Mac. If you have a PC, I'll actually have a link to someone who teaches, gives you a great tutorial about how to install uh, your localhost on your PC. And the next video is going to be about how to install WordPress on your localhost. All right, guys, if you have any questions, just comment. Thanks.